वेलकम बैक क्लास फोर्थ आई होप यू ऑल आर हेल्दी एट योर प्लेसेस एंड रेडी फॉर यू टी टू सो दिस वीडियो इज फॉर कंप्यूटर सब्जेक्ट बिफोर स्टार्टिंग एनी चैप्टर लेट्स हैव अ लुक ऑन द सिलेबस फॉर सेकेंड यू टी सो फॉर सेकेंड यू टी देर आर टू चैप्टर्स दैट इज चैप्टर नंबर थ्री टूल्स ऑफ वर्ड प्रोसेसर एंड चैप्टर नंबर फोर the internet web browser first we are going to start with the chapter number 3 tools of word processor so open this chapter in your books it's on page number 27 word processor now what is word processor word processor is a software as you already know that computer is made up of hardware and software and word processor is a software which enables us to process or to write words paragraphs pages or entire document if you want to write something in in computer you can use word processor software it is used to create documents we can store also that means we can save our document in computer also and uh, if we want we can display it on the screen we can edit it or we can enter characters commands through keyboards and print it on a paper so there are various things we can do with this software now Microsoft Word 2010 it is a most famous and very popularly used software for word processor okay so it is a word processing program which help us to write letters reports etc beautifully we can write our letters or reports to our friends or relative anyone we can add borders shading tables we can add pictures or graphics in our document to make it look more beautiful okay word can detect the errors while we are typing in a variety of language so if there is any spelling mistake they can tell you by underlining that word it is very helpful so we can edit it and format the text by using various tools in ms word now how can we use microsoft word 2010 in computer that means how can we start microsoft word there are four steps which we need to follow it is mentioned in your book you can have a look on those points from your books so the first step is we have to click on the start button when we click on start button start menu will appear and in start menu you will choose the second step that is you will click on all program as you can see on the screen first step is click the start button second step is select all program third step is click on microsoft office and finally click on microsoft office 2010 when you click on this an empty document titled document 1 appears on your screen like this here you can start writing your documents or whatever you want to write okay so these four steps you need to follow to open microsoft word now next page page number 28 now there are various components of word window so we will continue with this in our next video till then just revise the first chapter of your lesson number 3 okay thank you